Hi guys, so right now I'm going to teach you how to make a, a real rainbow loom ring. Okay, because in the other episode, Gianna taught you how to make just like the fake rainbow loom ring. So what you're going to need is you're going to need two greens, two fuchsias, four oranges, and five pinks, and then the C-clip. And you can use any colors that you like, but those are the colors that I'm going to use. And now you're going to need your crocheting hook and your template. And you can get this kit at Learning Express or, or you can go to twistbands.com and you can get them from Hallmark, I believe, too. So what you're going to do is you're going to make sure the arrow is pointing away from you. So you're going to grab a green, or actually no, you're going to grab the pink, you're going to go to the middle peg to the bottom behind, under it, and then you're going to go grab another pink, and you're going to go from this peg to this peg. That's what it's going to look like. Okay, so now you're going to grab your orange, and you're going to start from this peg and go to the left. Like that. I'm going to grab another orange, go from this peg to the left. And then you're going to grab green, whatever color. And you're going to go from this peg, the left peg, to the middle. So the left peg to the middle. Then you're going to go from the right peg to the middle. Okay, so it kind of looks like a line and then a diamond. Okay, so now you're going to take <clears throat> another orange. Gonna put from this peg to the left. Yeah, let me. I'm a righty. Uh, yeah, kind of. Hold on, Mom. I'm making a video. Yeah, Orange to this, and then like that. Okay. So now you're gonna take fuchsia. You're gonna go from that peg, from this peg to this peg to the left peg to the middle, then the right peg yeah. to there. What, Mom? What? Can you bring me my sweatshirt? Yes, hold on. <laughs> okay. And then, sorry, I was like, wrong. Then you're going to take a pink, and you're going to put it from this peg, the middle peg, forward. No, because I'm making the video. Then you're going to go from that peg, forward. Then you're going to go from this peg, forward. Okay, so that's what it should look like. Okay. So now you're ready to get your crochet hook and hook it. So you're going to start from the second peg. You're going to bring it up to, to this one. Okay? So you're going to grab this one and put it to this one. So now you're going to push these out of the way. Grab this pink one and bring it up to the other one. So now you're going to grab... Sorry. Let me just grab it. Alright, so now you're going to... Grab the, the top color and bring it to your left. The top rubber band, I mean. And then you're going to grab the other rubber band and bring it to your right. Okay. So now you're going to go to the left um, thing, the left peg, and you're going to pick up this orange and bring it to the middle. You're going to go to the right peg, pick up this orange, and bring it to the middle. Like that. Okay, so you're just going to push these down. Then you're going to push all these oranges out of the way. Grab the green one. And bring it to the left side. Then you're going to push all the oranges out of the way again. Grab the green one and bring it to the right side. Now you're going to push this green out of the way. On the left peg and grab the, left, the orange rubber band on the left peg and bring it to the middle. Then you're going to grab the right peg, the right or the orange um, band, rubber band on the right peg and bring it to the middle. Okay, so that's what it should look like. Now you're going to push all of these rubber bands out of the way. Grab the pink and bring it up to this one. So grab the pink, bring it up to that one. And then grab this pink and bring it up to that one. So this is what it should look like when you're done crocheting it. Like weaving it, whatever. So now you're ready to pull. So what, you, what I did is I just took my, my hook and I just picked it up, picked the right hand up, and I pulled. 
So then you're going to place them on your finger like that. Grab a C clip. I have C clip. And hook it. And you're going to take the other end and also hook that. Okay? And that's what the finishing ring looks like. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and please subscribe down below and comment also down below. Um, if you need any help or any questions, just comment and I'll be glad to make another video for you and help. Alright, thank you, bye!